Russian mass media claim that at the end of 2023, the airborne troops of the Russian army should receive the first serials of AD artillery control systems on the chassis of the Rakushka BTRMDM tracked armored personnel carrier. According to them, such unit can provide communication between UAVs and artillery, equipped with an optical electronic station with a target detection range of up to 7 km, as well as tank navigation equipment, an artillery compass, a rangefinder, and a thermal imager. Such solution is supposed to improve the fire efficiency of the Russia's artillery by 1.5 to 2 times, in particular, units with known S self-propelled guns. It is interesting that in 2021, Russians already announced the start of putting the Zazvet systems into service, but on the BMP-3 chassis. The number of vehicles and the military districts where systems were to be delivered to were not disclosed. But then Russians claimed that Zave could also coordinate the fire of anti-tank complexes and manpads. For that this system was apparently equipped with appropriate sets of remote equipment. The very attempt to put into serial production a system that is supposed to improve artillery fire control is already worthy of attention, taking into account the level of Russia's dependence on the supply of electronics and microchips from the West or China. Serially produced Zave systems will obviously be a sub-sanctioned type of weaponry.